part of the project to promote the conservation of endangered species in forest reserves in Ghana. Presbyterian University College embarked on 16 month project with the help from Critical Ecosystem Partnership Fund through BirdLife International to assess the status of primates in three forest reserves in Ghana and also embark on community conservation education programs in French communities in these reserves. <coughs> We've done a lot of them and now we are in Cape Three Points Forest Reserve, the French communities around Cape Three Points. And this very program was embarked on community, six communities around Cape Three Points Forest Reserves. And they are Akatechi, Suboy, Abla, Ablazo, Anomal Krum, Cape Three Point Town itself, and Slimew. We gathered members from various communities under these villages to converge in these communities and had community meetings with them. We presented the state of primates in, the, in this country, the world at large, and Africa to the community members. And they appreciated a lot. <laughs> Kanyabusi <laughs> Diamond Four year 
destroy their habitat. You don't and a high the whole world has recognized what you are doing. I think Prime Banner now I feel it's a yen yen kwa. A brofu, a bibi four, a brofu, a beba beshe kwa yen ya. A kwa yen sika bibri waha. Enti, because usha hana, mo wo, mo wo, mo ye lucky. Because, e poda ha. Ubi beti mi ako princess town, ako shek, fort ne wo ho. If you want bar, you bet me off a hack of coin. I compare way be happy. Oh, bar in so I a ton or how better be a impo omu rantia or hand bet me a yes or more tall guides. Now, omu de profo a coin. Enti Kakra a becker a far a far a moano in ye. Now, you bet be a coin so be a beer. Nothing will be some ye. And I must be brave. Mr. <laughs> Because Maybe ba, but so you beat to say sa adui or Oh, mama to, who bubu nyana? Sa bo wo nyana zbiano nti naso. Enti so big ba nta bo, because omo kwa, ebi ne big as omo kwa nuts, nuts be two o'clock. Omo kite two, it wo wo kwa.
Not what I mean. reserve in which they, their lives depend on are hosting some of these primates of conservation importance. So among others, the community members also suggested ways of conserving these forests and also asked questions concerning the way forward to this conservation program. They offered to volunteer in helping to protect the forest against poachers and also um, demanded that we converge, we communicate this message to the government that the forest guards in the area is too scanty to protect the forests. So if the government can support some volunteers to help reinforce the forest guards, 
in the area, they would have appreciated it much. There were questions and answer sessions during the period. Some of the women of note is the women who also shown keen interest in conserving the forest because part of their livelihood depend on this forest. They, they take medicinal plants from the forest as well as observing the, the fruits and leaves that these monkeys depend on as medicine to also derive medicine for humans. So they, they were very appreciative for, for this program and demanded for more. Emphasize that K3 Point is very unique forest for its ability to contain some of these endangered species. Of note is the black and white colobus, which the world has listed it among the topmost 25 endangered primates and we found them in Cape Three Points Forest Reserve. It also has white leaf mangabe, which is also difficult to find in many forest reserves in the country. So, I was suggesting to the public and to the government is to convert Cape Three Points Forest Reserve to a national park. Already, it is classified as um, one of the World Biodiversity Conservation Areas. So, no team, official timber harvesting is allowed. Now, it is located uniquely because to the south of the three points is the Gulf of Guinea. And on Ghana map, you can locate this Cape Three Points there, which attracts a lot of tourists to the area. Even GNPC has a tower there, and climbing this tower offers a good relief as a tourist site. So when we tailor make this tourist attraction to the forest, it will be very unique area. There are even resorts around, like Escape. Escape is a resort that attracts many foreigners to the place. And to the, to the west is Princess Town. And there's a fort that was built by one of the princesses in the town. But if you, if you enter into this fort, you enjoy it because you see the sea and also the shape of the Ghana map, south of Ghana map uniquely. So if a tourist go there, he can have the opportunity to observe most of these endangered primates in the forest reserve. And from there, he proceeds to the sea to relax on the shore. There are under unique places like the Lucia Beach Resort to the east. However, the road network to the area is very, very, very poor and it requires one to have a 4x4 vehicle before you can visit this place. Probably if the, with the discovery of oil in western region, the government can take that opportunity to convert Cape Three Points to a forest reserve. Going further is in Zulezu, um, Zulezu wetlands area, which also offer a unique tourist attraction. So when somebody is, if this place is promoted as a tourist hub, traveling to Western region will be very unique because it's the K3 Points Forest Reserve doesn't only conserve the, the endangered primates, but it also promotes the 
local climate. The area is is endowed with the soil that that supports rubber plantation. So almost all the land in the area has been converted into rubber plantation. And this is the only forest reserve that is keeping the representative samples of plants and animals in the area. So if we sit down aloof and allow it to be destroyed by selfish chainsaw operators, hunters, and other uses of the forest, um, we will lose all the biodiversity that we have. So, in conclusion, we are calling all the stakeholders. These are the NGOs operating in the area, like the West African Primate Action, Action Group, WAPCA, who is conserving um, biodiversity in Western region. There's Wildlife, Wildlife Division, Managing Ankasa Resource Reserve at Elubo, which is also close by the Forestry Department, Forestry Services Division, and the Forestry Commission, who is in charge of the records. So, plus, our university, the University Presbyterian University College, who, who is championing this project, to come together and appeal to the government to to change the status of the three points to a national park, thereby conserving the natural resources in it. There are other unique resources also outside the protected area, which are beds of conservation importance, seashore beds, who, who, which can be found along the Gulf of Guinea. And we can tailor make all this to form a tourist hub and as well as protect the biodiversity in this area. This will also serve as an employment source for young men and women who are found wanting to get jobs. They can be trained as tour guides to, to and also forest guards to protect this forest and earn some income from the tourists that comes to the area. So this is our message to the public, to the government and to every stakeholder who have interest in forest and forest resources. Thank you very much for your attention.